So, uh, uh, yeah, don't worry about it. What was it? Advanced Automotive Technologies. Rochester, Michigan. So, um, this is a 2003 Corvette and it has a 1953 uh, conversion kit on it. And this, this car was the star of the show. Uh, at the La Jolla Classic Car Show, this car got a lot of attention. Uh, at Corvette Row, it was a very popular car. Uh, Ray, can you open up one of the doors and, and yeah. throw it up and kind of show them how that... Uh, Oh yeah. This door stays up really good. I gotta adjust the other one. It's just such a cool car. It's such a one of a kind when it comes to Corvettes. It's in mint shape. What size engine does the uh, 2003 Vet have? 350. A 350, yeah. I love those rims on there too. And that front end grill is super cool. Where did you get the rims at, Ray? These are uh, these aren't the original rims on the 2003. No, these were rims that you got specifically for Craig's the car. Craigslist. Craigslist. Got them for five hundred dollars for a set of four. Nice. That was a deal of the day. That, that is a deal of the day. And my favorite part of the car is this front end. Get a look at that Advanced grill. Made all of those parts too. That's not a Corvette front end. That's custom made to look like the Corvette. The teeth, you know. Yeah. Yeah, I love the way that front end, that grill is set up. So you basically uh, shipped the car back to them. They yeah. uh, did the modifications and then shipped it back I it, over. I had it back in about three and a half months. Mine's the only one they did the doors to. The only one that had the doors that went up like yeah. that, yeah. And the other thing I did to it since I got it back, I hid the exhaust. Corvettes always have all the exhaust pipes hanging out. It looks like an ad for a plumbing shop. <laughs> and, uh, you, you can't see them at all now. They're completely gone. <laughs> yeah, I like the plate too. 0353. 2003 Corvette with a uh, 1953 conversion kit. I'll walk around the back here too so we can check out the back of the car. I might have those done in yellow and black now too. What's that? The uh, license plate. There's a guy that custom makes plates. Oh, yes, yeah, so you can do the, the classic style plate. Yeah, you get it for the 57. Yeah. You get it for the 34 in the old colors. And I might have it done because that would, that would really throw people off then. I think I've had the old plates. Oh, yeah. They'd really be confused. We couldn't have picked a better day today either. Oh, I mean, great. middle of January, it's probably about 65 degrees already. Yeah, this back end is so darn cool. It almost looks like a Batmobile. That's what people call it, yeah. Hey, Ray? Yeah. Do you have a button that lifts that up like a bolt? Because you open the traditional menu. Is that right? So you can use the doors either way. So you can pull it down, open it up, traditional, yeah. and then you just push it up. Yeah, that's right. This door opens up like a normal door would, it and then it has the wide. option where it can go straight up like this. And uh, I shot this car, well, I don't know, about a year ago, I guess now, not quite, six, eight months ago with a swimsuit model Leslie. So if you go to our www.socalbeachmag.net site, you can see some great photos of this car. Get a little better look at this uh, back end. So Ray, um, every weekend now still on uh, Saturday mornings and on uh, Sunday mornings. Sunday mornings. We, we kind of changed it rather than 7 to 9. We're doing it like from about 8 to 10. 8 to 10, yeah. That's probably... A little too early. It was a little too cold. A little too cold, too, yeah. 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 
But that's good. So if anybody is out there that's a classic car fan or a sports car fan, hot rods, hot rods classic, cars, classic cars, you can come down here right in front of uh, Jackson La Jolla, which is right on the corner of uh, Wall Street and Girard, and check out some really cool cars on the weekends here in downtown La Jolla Village. And for more pictures of this car, you can go to our website, www.socalbeachmag.net.